There we go. I'm sorry about that, but what's going on, you guys? It's your girl, Press Conversation. Welcome back to the channel today. This is the very first episode of Curiosity House Generations. Um, told y'all I was going to get started on the return of LPs. If you have not seen the previous video, it'll explain a, a little bit of um, how the saves are going to work. But, you know, you're not here for that. You're here for... Well, I need my own house. Um, you're actually here for the LP, and I'm gonna get ready to introduce everybody. God dang. So the first person I'm gonna introduce is Amy. <laughs> she is my uh, my little. Well, how, how about I describe Amy? Amy is my little my little uh, wired up sim, if you will. She's erratic, ambitious, and romantic, and she has. Family, I think the successful lineage trait. So she is domestic. Yeah, she has a successful lineage. So this will be uh, great because this is kind of like a legacy, a legacy challenge for me, and I wanted to you know, at least try with, with my very first group of Sims that I created into a household. Next up, we got Cecil. <laughs> he is my entertaining sim. Um, he's materialistic, good, and non-committal. <laughs> and he is going to be a mass mixologist. But he's going to, because he has the non-committal trait, he's going to switch from different um, careers. Uh, these sins can become tense after a while in the same job relationship, become happy when they quit a job or break off a relationship, take long to oppose, and can discuss their fear of commitment. So, I am looking forward to using that. And who's next? Next up, we got Brent. Brent is my active sim, my gym head, you know. He is a bro, active and romantic, and he has a high metabolism from the athletic um, aspiration. And we're gonna actually use him with um, and with the fitness stuff. Um, why do you look like that? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. Maybe, maybe it's just how this uh, this is uh, looking. And the person who's walking away, my oh my, look at that. Oh, big old, big old. This is Rita Rose. She sounds like the leader of the group, and she's my party sim. And she is also materialistic, outgoing, and snobbish. And she is gregarious um, because of the party animal trait. Um, don't pay attention to these reward traits. I think these come with wicked whims. And no, you won't be seeing no, no, no explicit content. Um, most of my Twitter content will be going to my Patreon. Uh, so, just thought I'd let y'all know about that. So, before you get excited, ain't gonna be no cutscene to them freaking getting freaky deaky. I'll put the levels up and put the um, exclusive button. Well, now nah, I'm not gonna put that type of content on there until like later in the series. Because, yeah. Um, if you want to know what happened to him the first time, uh, there will be a playlist in the uh, description below, and you'll see what happened to him the first time, and and you'll kind of get a reason why I decided to start over, uh, because um, when I first dealt with this family, yeah, they kind of like a family, yeah. When I first dealt with this family, they were not young adults. You know what I mean? They were straight up adults. They were all adults. Every single last one of them. And when they became elders, it was kind of difficult to play with them because 
I was just like, well, what what do I do? You know what I mean? And then they all died. And when I, I didn't know that until I went to the house because I wanted to do an episode of, of the original Curiosity House. And the last person to die was Cecil. So they're not, I don't know if they're gonna die in, in um in this uh series. Did I go down the first episode? Like that that'd be weird. But yeah, this is their apartment. This is Amy's room, Brent's room, Cecil's room is over there, and Rita's room is right here. And I noticed that they might have to share a, a bathroom or something because literally every single every bathroom is occupied by Amy and Rita. You know what I mean? So, I don't know about that. But, Amy, you're actually going to get up and talk to the neighbors. Because you see that over there? They over there. They decide to get freaky diggy. And, you know. Should we not politely should we pound on the door? I think we should not politely. You know, because we just got here. Like, we literally just got here. They over there getting freaky deaky while we watching TV and shit. And it's just like, damn, like, we over here trying to, you know, enjoy our little movie. And you over there getting freaky deaky. You hear them? That made no damn sense. Alright, so, you need to stop talking to him and you need to go over there and, and handle business. Do I gotta get Brent to do it? I guess I gotta get Brent to do it. Because obviously, you don't want to do it. So, we gotta get Brent to do it. Alright, so Brent getting up. Because, I don't know who told them to get Freaky Deaky and, and, and all that stuff. Ain't nobody telling them to get Freaky Deaky. I didn't tell them to do that. He is mad. But we need him to go over there politely because they're our neighbors. And we got to train with respect. So. Oh, now they want to stop. Ain't that about a bitch. Now they want to stop when we get to the door. You know what? Knock on the door. Knock on the door. Now, this is my first time actually using City Living. I just got City Living last year. Um, someone had a giveaway, and that was actually uh, one of the winners. And I actually got City Living as my gift. So, I, I need, I'm going to need, that is crazy. They're like, oh, snap, somebody probably at the door. Like, yeah, somebody probably at the door. Can you keep it the hell down? I'm starting to think this shit is not. You can't cook. Their skill levels are not up. Yeah, you cannot cook. So, you're going to sit down. <laughs> There's no point in getting mad now to everybody. You know what I mean? There's no point in getting mad now. They they done doing the freaky getting doing the freaky dicky. Everybody mad. Just everybody. It's just like, what the fuck? Like Oh my god. You know what I mean? So everybody just mad. We just gonna This is gonna be really interesting. Oh, they watching the action thing. Okay, so we're going to switch to this. Um, what movies can we watch? Because I got um, I got movie hangout so we can watch movies together. No, no. I pretty much watched every single last movie that was on there. So they can watch. What is civic public access? What is that? I'm going to find out what that is. What's this, like PBS? Oh, it is like PBS. Oh, shoot. Just by watching this? Was that guy in a bear suit giving a speech about the benefits of <laughs> pescatarianism? I like this. Okay. This is actually pretty dope. So I'm liking this already. Maybe we'll get them to go out in San Mashuno and kind of get to look at the city. Um. Oh my god. What is this? Little bootleg bachelorette. 
And she get freaky dicky with all of them. What? What? You getting down? Wait a minute. Who's spending money? Who the hell making a drink? That's not you. It's not you. It's him. Brent. You didn't even go all the way over there and already you making a drink. How the f how does that work? How does that work, Brent? Did you walk? Wait a minute. Did you just walk over? Okay, Brent. I'm gonna need for you to chill. Okay. That, that's crazy. How you just gonna sit over there? Oh, they. Oh, oh. What's going on? What's going on here? It's a lot of interesting things on here. I'm just gonna watch the current channel. Everybody just chilling, doing their thing. What did you make? I just wanna know. What's that? Rum and Coke? You better drink that shit too, yo. Please tell me you drinking it. And you didn't do that shit for your health. Oh no, nah, nigga. Oh, I gotta stop cussing y'all. He need to go drink that. You made it, you drank it. Like my sister's not gonna be leaving cups and all that mess. Look at this, messy with her skin. I don't know what it is. Oh, this really That is crazy. I don't know y'all what y'all think. This is public access crap. I'm sorry this is laggy because I'm normally used to having, I don't know why this is so laggy, but I can't, uh, I'll try and fix it. See, see the bathroom? Dang. All right, well, I'm gonna end the episode right here. Uh, I hope you guys kind of, kind of got like a a little bit of what's this stuff going to be about. It's only going to be about them being on uh, being under one roof, living amongst each other as friends, and hopefully spreading out and creating families, hopefully together, maybe not together. We don't know. But, um... In the next episode, they'll probably be out and about in uh, in the city of San Mashuno, which is all the way down there and stuff. So, yeah. I hope you all enjoyed the first episode. It's not going to be too long anyway. Um, I love you guys. I'll see you in the next one. But until then, you already know. Peace.